Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Uh, as you can tell, I had work today, so I hope that you all have noticed the trend that if I come to you with a doodle bug, hello, get out of here, yeah. So like I was saying, I hope y'all have noticed the trend that if I come to you with a face full of makeup and my Sephora uniform on, it only means one thing. Gratis! And if you can tell, I have not one bag, but two bags full of gratis. Um, it's been about two months since I last got my gratis, so it makes sense that this is a lot more than normal. Uh, typically, I'll get gratis signed out to me like once a month, so this is basically two months worth of products. So I am so excited to get into it. The first thing that I got actually is not in those bags because um, they gave it to me one day randomly when I was at work um, a couple of weeks ago, but I've just been saving it for this haul. And that is the, oh, the Too Faced Sweet Peach Palette. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me, Sephora? Oh, thank you so much. Um, I am so grateful for all the products that I get. But this one in particular was on my wish list, so this is what the palette looks like. Uh, everyone basically has already seen it and done reviews on it, but I am fortunate enough to have gotten it in gratis. So I have actually played around with this. I have a look uh, coming soon to my channel with this palette. Um, it is wonderful. It does smell like peaches like an artificial peach flavor or scent it smells I really like it um the pigmentation oh the pigmentation when I played with it was excellent I have no complaints about this palette so far I'm absolutely loving it and I'm so thankful that I got it in gratis so I'm just gonna open up these bags and go through the products that I got um the first thing that I pulled out are some cards. Um, you know that with products, these are meant to be learning tools. So I get information cards that I read through so that way I can learn more about the product, not just test it out, but actually read and learn about the product. So that's always good to have. I got this Bite Beauty, um, has my name on it, Whitney. And when you open it up, it's actually the brand new lip balm that they came out with and a trio sample of the Agave Lip Mask, which I already know that I love the Agave Lip Mask. I use it almost every night to moisturize my lips and recondition them for the next day. I am excited to try this balm out, so I'm super glad I got that. Um, next in this bag is a full-size Urban Decay Primer. This is one of the new ones that just came out. This is the Optical Illusion Complexion Primer. I was so glad that this is the one that I got because this is the only one that I've heard decent to good reviews about. All of the other ones that they came out with, I've heard nothing but like negative reviews. So I'm really glad that I got this one. So that way there's a chance that I might actually like it. Ole Henriksen repackaged their um, skincare line. So this is the new packaging for the Sheer Transformation um, Moisturizer. So I have actually received this in gratis a few times and I've used it every single time. Um, it's not something that I would personally purchase, but I get it in gratis and it's good enough as a moisturizer to use. So I do use it, but it's not, it's not outstanding for the price. So it's not something that I would purchase. The next item that I got is, this is actually a, oh, this is the All Day Luminous Powder Foundation from NARS and this is in the shade light 5 Fiji um I have the NARS all day luminous liquid foundation and I have it in the shade Deauville so I think this is a shade above it so it might be a little dark for me um but you know I'm gonna use it I'll make it work somehow I love when I get um foundation type or powder type stuff in this bag, I also got a full size of the Skin Laundry Gent Gentle Foaming Face Wash. Ideal for normal to sensitive skin. So I've never tried anything from Skin Laundry, so it's exciting to get products and gratis that I've never tried because who knows, this could turn out to be a holy grail for, um, face wash for me. So it's gentle and foaming. It helps to clean, calm, and soften. This is a big bottle, two 6.7 ounces, so that's a lot of face wash. 
And then the last thing in this first bag is a fragrance. Um, this is the Blue de Chanel, and this is the Eau de Toilette. So um, this is a men's fragrance. We do sell men's fragrance at Sephora, so or at my Sephora. So um, we do often get men's fragrances as well. I um, hope that my husband likes this. If not, we'll be donating it to someone who will. On to the second bag of gratis. Give y'all a little sneak peek right there. So. I have these um, little organza bags with more information cards in them. So that's information on products in these bags that I can read up on and learn about the products. <gasps> I'm so excited about this. This is the Sol de Janeiro Acai Body Power Cream. This stuff, I smelled it in the tub. Mmm, smells so good. Let me put some on. It smells so good. I'm just doing a little bit. Um... I have put this on in store because I love the way that their products smell. That is very moisturizing. I want to see how it sinks into the skin because I hate lotions that don't sink in very well. Mmm, the scent is really good. It's not as, um, like, pina colada as the original one. This is the acai one. This is really good. And it sunk into the skin's pretty nice. I'm still a little... I was going to say I'm still a little kind of tacky, but it's it's sinking in pretty nicely. It's nice. Okay. I'm happy about that. This is from the brand Kopari, and I never heard about this until I did see someone on YouTube mention it. And then, next thing you know, I'll get it in my gratis bag. So, this is the Coconut Mini Melt. So... It says that it is, oh, let's see, vegan, paraben-free, cruelty-free, and silicone-free. So, basically, you melt a dollop in your hands and coconut your bod from head to toe. So, this can be used anywhere in your body to help soften. Okay, cool. It's just coconut oil, I think. And I think this brand's pretty pricey, so I don't know what they put in. If you've tried this, let me know if it's any good or any better than any other coconut product. Ooh. Like I said earlier, I love getting foundations in uh, gratis. This is the NARS Sheer Matte Foundation, and I got mine in the shade Medium 2 Santa Fe. So, this is probably, although it looks like it's going to be a good match, um, we'll have to try it and see. I think it's a little, it says Medium 2, that's kind of dark. Hopefully it'll match me. If not, you know I mix all my foundations anyway, so it'll, I'll make this work. Don't worry. But I've been really curious. I know this is like an OG YouTube favorite. I've never tried it, so I'm curious to see how I like it. And I'm so glad that I get to try it out, um, and I'm glad that I got it in gratis. Okay, so I got the SK2. Uh, this is the Essence, Facial Treatment Essence. This stuff is very pricey, so I don't know if they sell, like, these small bottles. This is, how many ounces? This is one fluid ounce. So, I know this stuff is super pricey. I'm excited to try it out. But I don't really notice too much of a difference from using an essence, like a toner. I already have a Holy Grail toner, so we'll see how this works out and if it's worth the price. Urban Decay also repackaged some of their products. This is the setting spray all-nighter. I absolutely love this. It is one of my holy grails. I still have two or three bottles at least of the old packaging that I stocked up on. Mm -hmm. So this will just go in the collection. I love these mini bottles. Um, the spritzer on these is really good. And I don't really travel too much, but I love this product, so I will certainly use this up. I got this little bag from Mew Mew. And inside of it is a heart. That looks like boobies on the end. <laughs> um, it looks, let's see. Oh, okay. So it's a phone, it's a, you can plug this into your phone and I guess that creates two more, two outlets instead of one. Okay, that's kind of cool. I mean, I don't know if I'll ever use that. Maybe I'll throw that in a giveaway, but, um, I'll give it to one of my friends who might have more use for that. It is really cute though. I got this little sample size of the Lancome Visionaire um, eye corrector. Oh, it's an eye balm. So that's actually a pretty decent size for an eye cream. Uh, well, I mean, it's small, but uh, you don't need a lot for eye products. So hopefully this is pretty good.
Next, I received a full-size Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. Uh, this stuff I have a love-hate relationship with, so this is plenty of product for me to go through to see if I really love it. I think on some days I love it, some days I hate it. It's very similar to the like drugstore Maybelline uh, Baby Skin. And I like that most days, so maybe I just was using this maybe too much because I know if I use that one like too much of it, it doesn't work. So I will definitely retry this out and see how I like it. From Kate Somerville, I got the Wrinkle Warrior 2-in-1 Plumping Moisturizer Plus Serum. That's always good to have a 2-in-1 so that way I don't have to do multiple steps. Save me some time. Maybe in the morning can this be used a.m.? a.m. and p.m. so excellent I'll try out this little sample and maybe I can save myself some time in the morning and if I really like it I can repurchase it from living proof I got the restore perfecting spray this is a conditioning detangling spray so I have a ton of hair products and leave-in conditioners so I will just put this in rotation and see how I like it there are other living proof items that I absolutely love so I don't see why this one would be any different. Ooh, I know it's crazy to get this excited about a liquid liner, but this is one of my favorite liquid liners. This is the black liquid liner from Stila. It's the Stay All Day Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner. And between this and the Kat Von D liquid liner, those two are my absolute favorites. They are so easy to wing out your eye. This is the Kat Von D on my eyes right now. But they are equal in my opinion, and I love both of them. So I am very happy to have that seal aligner. Uh, some more skincare I got from the brand Fresh. So this is the Black Tea Age Delay Cream from Fresh. And I've never tried um, a face cream like this from the brand Fresh. I know that it's a really good brand that sells in Sephora. So I'm really excited to try this. Oh, is there something different? <laughs> Yes, yesterday when I was filming this, my gratis haul, my camera battery died. I did not know, so now I have to pick up the next day with filming the rest of it. So that's what happens. We're just going to move on with the rest of my gratis haul. So that was the item from Fresh, and this is a pretty good size 0.67 fluid ounces. Um, it says advanced antioxidants firms, protects, and hydrates. So I'm really excited to try this out. We have a Briogeo Despair, Don't Despair Repair Hair Mask. I have tried this before. Um, I wasn't overly impressed with it, but I'll give it another try and see if it's any different or if I like it any different now. I did get another Chanel um, perfume. This is the new version of the Chanel number no. five, number no. five Lou. And this is supposed to have fresher top notes than the original number five, but still the same basic floral tone. So the first bottle that I got of, this is my second bottle of this that I've gotten in gratis. The first bottle I gave to my mother. She liked it. She loved it. Um, this bottle I'm actually going to give to her because she has a friend at work who loves this scent or loves the original number five. So I know I'm never going to wear this. So I'm not going to keep it. I am going to pass it along. But it was really nice to get a full-size perfume in gratis. I'm really excited about this next product. This is the It CC Cream Plus from It Cosmetics. Um, I'm so excited that Sephora started carrying this brand. Uh, I have used this in the past. I've purchased it. I've used it up. I have mine in the shade Medium. I will use this and I do enjoy it. This is a small sample size of a face cream from Youth to the People. This is the Kale and Spinach Green Tea Hyal Hyaluronic Acid. Um, I feel that I think that this is just a good moisturizing cream, so we'll try it out and see. It's just a small little sample. I got this rollerball from Nest Fragrances. This is in the brand new scent of Black Tulip. It is really good. I smelled it in the store and I'm so excited that I got this in gratis. I will definitely use this up. It's a little bit exotic and Nest is a brand is a little bit earthy. So if you like those types of scents, go check out Nest. It's really good. I got a NARS lip liner in the shade uh, I, oh Costa Sm Smeralda. That sounds crazy but okay uh it's a beautiful pink tone i'm not a huge lip liner fan but i will try this out if it's too pink for me then i will pass it along i received this anastasia brow brush um it has 
a nice angled tip and then the spoolie on the other side. I received this Marc Jacobs um, eyeliner in this purple shade called Mist Me. It is a beautiful pastel purple tone. I swatched it right here for you guys. These, This is the new matte line that came out so when you put it on it dries matte and when these set they really set um, completely. They do not budge or smudge or anything so these are great pencils. They're a little bit more expensive but they are really good quality. I got an item from Tatcha. Uh, this is the Tatcha The Essence. So it says it's a plumping skin softener, anti-aging complex. So I think this is kind of like the SK2 essence where you just kind of pat it on the face and it's supposed to make like a world of difference. We'll try it out and see, but for the price, it's probably not anything great. But hey, maybe I might be wrong. If you've tried it, let me know. And then the last set of items that I got were from Drunk Elephant. I can't hold the packaging properly. Um... This is a skincare line that has excellent reviews on Sephora's website. Um, I got the Lala Retro Whipped Cream. I guess this is a moisturizer. And then I got the TLC Sukari Baby Facial Resurface and Reveal. That seems pretty cool. And then this last one is the Virgin Marula Luxury Face Oil. Um, I do have oily skin, but I do enjoy using oils at nighttime to really help to replenish the skin. So this is a line that I'm excited to use um, because, like I said, it has gotten excellent reviews online and excellent feedback from people in the store. So... I know that this was a long video. This was a massive haul. This was two months worth worth of gratis. And I cannot be more grateful for getting these things from Sephora to try out and let clients who come into the store know what I feel about them or if I wear them. They can see different looks that I create. So if you've tried any of these products or own any of these products and love them, let me know below. And thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Subscribe so that way you can check out all of my future videos. And thank you so much for watching. That's it. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.